Vectra basically is a blood test that would be sent to a central lab that has a total amount of validity and safety associated with performing the test. And then a specific number is defined that correlates with the level of inflammation, correlates with the level of damage, correlates with the thermostat of the illness at that moment. It's called back to the doctor. The doctor then can compare it over time from baseline and compare it to their assessment, their evaluation of how the patient is doing. The beauty of the company that's making Vectra is that they very carefully considered the patient as a key part of the triad of the illness, the patient, and the doctor. And they will have online capacity for patients to have sway over their own destiny. They can then see how they're doing, go to the doctor and say, what's going on? I'm both not feeling well, and this test shows me to not be doing well. What can we do to optimize it? Right now, patients are very passive. Some want to be passive, some don't, but don't know how to be part of the partnership. This will enable them to do this. This is an enabling phenomenon. And it can give us input every few weeks or every few months to see exactly how my illness is doing and how I could make it better. Where was I here and how did I get here? And if I go up, what happened? How can I bring it back down again? How can I fine tune it in a safe, responsible manner?